what's up guys so this is going to be the gunk series and i'm just starting it today recorded it today and good afternoon and have a good day She'd say she want us to land and go explore. No, you want us to land so you can go explore. One up to you, Captain. Since when am I the captain? We took the loan together. You both have to pay the mortgage. Hey, here's something. You feel like analyzing some scan data? That's what we're here for? Scan away. Just a basic composite of silicate. No energy reading to speak of. So, we can't sell it? Not unless we find a million of them. Wait, the signal's back. Weaker though, and I can't get a clear reading. There's some stuff down here causing interference. Come take a look. What in the world? Huh, a blob of gum. Yeah, that's an apt name for it. Can you scan it without getting too close? I don't know what's in it. Looks like snot. If it is, I don't want to meet the thing that Keep your mask on. Seems to be some sort of organic compound. Luckily, I don't think it's snot. Think you can use your glove to clean it up? All right, what do you say, pumpkin? Can we clean it up? What's up with the radio reception? Beautiful. Interesting is what it is. Give me that data. <gasps> you sure you didn't get super glue in the scanner? A hundred percent. Why? The pattern kind of looks like the signal we got before, just weaker. If the reading is right, this stuff's got some energy potential. For real? Keep your head screwed on. This puddle's not much to write home about. But if we can find a bigger deposit, I think we should look for a place to land. Sweet! Light the way! <sighs> Not getting through here. Hmm. More gunk on the other side of these nasty vines. If 
we find more of that substance, our poor days might be over. I could get a garden of my own back home. What would you do? Pay our bills? I meant after that. I know. But I don't dream big until I know it's within my reach. A dream, Bex, is something that's out of our reach. Otherwise, it's called an option. up for the bunny, right? Yeah, but I can't take her down until that gunk's gone. Care to clean it up? Oh yeah, it'll be our pleasure. On. Hope it helps with the signal. off this time. You got third. Maybe you should take a look at his code. Yesterday he ran all of my tools through the washing machine. Uh, yeah. That storm was rough, and I don't like the look of that river. I'll run some diagnostics on Bunny just to be safe. Now? I was thinking we could do some exploring? Together? Avoid the boring stuff, you mean. No, I just thought... I know, Ronnie, but I have to take care of the ship first. Look, I'm running a constant scan for the energy signal. Why don't you remove some more gunk and see if we pick it up again? Okay, if you say so, Cap. <laughs> Just be careful. This looks interesting. Check the data for me, please. What's up with your attention span? Aren't you gonna clean up some gunk? It's really compact. It looks like it could burst any minute. Ooh, that sounds like fun. Let's plant it. Volex, I can't rip it off. Mm, it roots deep underground. You'll need a proper fix for the glove. If you find some metal ore for the soldering alloy, you could repair it once and for all. If we're gonna stick around here for a while, I'm really going to need it. Pretty bad. Wonder where it leads.
Lights on, pumpkin. You're not taking unnecessary risks now, huh? I never take unnecessary risks. Oh, yeah? What about that time on Beta Romulan? Ugh, that foreman didn't even listen. I warned her. That woman owes you half an arm. I could have died in that shitty mine. But instead, I got you. And this lovely glove. Glowing stuff sure looks interesting. I wonder. What are you up to? Since this is not worth harvesting, I might as well throw that seed thing in there and see what happens. Take cover, Kurt. Bex. I think I got what I need. Great, head yeah. back. Sweet, a shortcut. Go. Good as new, pumpkin. I'll be able to rip up that stubborn alien plant for sure. Stop chatting with your glove and just go pick the damn plant. All right, I guess I'll just throw this ball into that glowing stuff and see what happens, right? Got more of a green thumb than me. Son of a. Did you blow something up? Yeah, you could say that. I just grew myself a freaking staircase. A staircase? What? In the energy puddle? Huh, that's interesting. I'll tell you what, why don't you tell me about it back here? I'm all done, and I'm ready for the cow. In a few minutes, okay? You look like tired.
either. Yeah, there's definitely energy potential in this stuff. Right now, I just wish it was edible. Hey, why don't you just grab a gruel snack to hold you over? There's even some sorghum growing in the hydro. Set up your radio as a repeater for the ship's scanner. So I'm like a walking energy detector now? Your gear should pick up the energy signal if you happen to get within range while you're out there. This place looks promising. Seems like there's some stuff we could use here. Collect as much as you can. Bad. Maybe you should head back? I don't want to lose contact. This vegetation doesn't look right. Like the gunk is sucking the life out of it. Let me do something about it. I'll head back to you. I promise. <sighs> you think the gunk wants to cause harm? Like it's uh, you know, sentient or something? Sentient, that icky stuff? Jeez, I hope not. Been a while since I nailed a shot, but maybe I still got it. Ha! Yes! Ha! 
Some of these plants might make a nice stew. Want me to bring some back for you? Ugh. I cannot be bribed with alien gumbo ingredients. If you find a pack of beer or a tin of coffee beans, Ugh. I'm willing to talk. All right, I'll keep an eye out, but don't get your hopes up. There's more life here than we thought, Bex. I've encountered animals. What? Really? Did they have what? teeth and claws? Some of them did, yeah. If you get hurt, I will kill you. is literally a paradise when the gunk's gone. Lush and colorful and <sighs> amazing. I could just roll around and rub my face in it all. I wouldn't advise that. Hard to track energy signals when you're having an allergy attack. Take these, thank you very much.
place sure is something else. Hey, Ronnie. I had Kurt get a water sample from the river. It's thick with gunk. I hear ya. The stream doesn't look too inviting out here, either. What if the camp gets flooded? Honey would not approve of that. Animal, and it's the most beautiful creature I've ever seen. I'm gonna track it a little bit further. I have a credit for every time I hear what you say, I'm just gonna.
Good thing I'm not claustrophobic. alive, but, uh, but it seems like it's drawn to living things. It's like it's completely off balance. My best theory, yet, is the gunk is a waste product from some kind of ecosystem-related process. Like, who? You're eloquent as always. You're fast, but I wish you wouldn't run from me. I, I just want to look at you. we got here before anyone else? It doesn't look like much from space. If it wasn't for your pig-headed nature, we'd have skipped right past it. Good thing, too. The big corpse would trawl every last bit of life out of this place. Yeah, our connections aren't really the sort that would spend good credits on plants. But if we find the mother load of that energy, we can thank the stars we came first. All right, guys, we're going to end it off right there. I don't want the first part to be too long. So right here, this chapter two, looking for a signal slash rescue the animal. So second part, it would definitely be from rescue the animal and so forth. Thank you and have a good day.